Hey everyone, it's me, J416 here, back playing some Sonic Origin Story Mode. Last time we started Sonic 3 and Knuckles, and now, and well, we started it and also got all the Chaos Emeralds too. And now we're uh, in, we finished Hyrule City, so now we're in the Marble Garden Zone, and we, we can just now just play through the rest of the game. But we already got 50 rings, so we can already go Super Sonic. So. We can just get to just running through the game now, just like we did in Sonic 2. But yeah, Marble Garden Zone's a pretty good, uh, pretty cool zone. It's like, there's a lot of hills and a lot of, uh, like, switches you gotta pull to get to certain places. And there's also, you gotta watch out, especially when you're super, there's also traps that can squish you. So, you gotta watch out for that too. But, uh, other than that, nothing can really stop us as super. And as, I, as you can hear, uh, the super theme playing, this is actually a new theme that's not in the original game. Because the original game just had the, the invincibility theme. But, uh, okay. We got, we got an easy spinning top thing to get through. Yeah, but the original game just had the invincibility thing, but uh, in the beta of the game had actually this theme in it, but not this exact one, but a version of it, but uh, they went through, they went back, you know, person, uh, Jun Tsunoe is one of, the, he's one of the people that makes most of the, the music for Sonic, mainly modern Sonic, but actually this was the first game, Sonic game he worked on, but he, he came, he came back and made this, uh, this new one. Well, it's like, it's the old one, but finished. It's alright. It kind of sounds like Sonic 4, which is another classic game he made. Like, it's like a modern classic game, and the soundtrack for that's kind of, it's kind of iffy. It, it, I like it sometimes, but it, it doesn't really fit in this, but, uh, it's whatever. It ain't that bad. Yeah. Okay, you gotta watch out for that, because that can kill you. Run through. And we should be almost done with this act, to be honest, because we've been running through it pretty fast as super. Yep, alright. Now we're at the act one boss. This drill robot, he just. He's kind of like the. Well, y'all never saw the uh, Mystic Cave uh, boss because I skipped it, because I went to Hidden Palace Zone instead. But, uh. He's pretty much the exact same boss. He, with that boss, he drills into the ceiling, spikes come down, and it tries to come down and hit you, and then you just hit him. That's it. But uh, that's Act 1. Now it's time for Act 2. Sadly, it takes away our rings uh, between acts, so we gotta get our rings back to go super again. But we still have our electric shield, so, you know, we can, we can get all our rings back pretty easily. As long as we don't get hit. And you gotta watch out because Eggman's gonna pop out right here. I'm trying to attack you. Okay, we can't go that way, so we're going down. Oh, okay, we're supposed to go this way. Oh, oh, okay, Tails is dead. I almost died too, but uh... Good thing it was Tails and not me. We just need five more rings and we're, uh, good. Alright, now we can go Super Sonic. Okay, let's not get squished, please, alright? I do not want to get squished. And the cool thing about the the lightning shield is that it's the, like the only shield that you can really use while super. Because you know, well, you don't get a double double jump, but you do get the magnet effect of it. So a good combination is to get the lightning shield first, then get super, and then you just run past the rings and still get them. And it's really hard to lose super with the the electric shield. 
Alright, so we gotta go up here. And you know, just hit the checkpoint just in case, you never know. I don't think we're at the end yet, but uh, you know. Something, I might get squished or something, you never know. And it also is easier to do platforming with Sonic 3 Super Sonic, because he's not as slippery as Sonic 2 Super Sonic. But he is still slippery, but not as slippery, you know. Alright. And Tails having a hard time keeping up. <laughs> but he's trying his best, you know. Okay, I kind of wanted this. This is going to help. Okay. Alright. Let's keep running through. Destroy this thing right here. Oh, I thought there were some rings back there, I guess not. Oh, no! I did not mean to do that. Okay, well, I got rid of the lightning shield, and we're about to lose super anyway, so. This kind of sucks. Oh, never mind. Alright, we gotta let the, the ground, like, come up with us. I think there is a shield right here. Yep, there it is. But, but uh, we've lost super anyway, so. We can at least get some rings and a shield. Alright, so here comes Eggman with his, his big ass drill, and he's gonna destroy the rest of the, the ground. But, uh, good thing we got Tails, because he's here to help us fight Eggman, so... Pretty much with this boss, he's got to attack... Wow! Wow! I killed him super fast. That usually doesn't happen. Usually, I didn't think I, I, I don't think I've ever comboed him like that before. But, you know, usually you hit him. And every time you fall, Tails will pick you up. And Eggman likes to, would like to go in the background and, like, show up with different sizes of the screen. It's a pretty easy fight, but I didn't expect to kill him that fast, so... But, uh, now we're going to Carnival Night Zone, and now I can talk about the the music changes of uh, Sonic Origins. So, uh, Sonic 3 actually had Michael Jackson and some of his uh, producers like compose some music for this game, and well, I can't even get up there. And uh, yeah, so this. And it was a completely different theme of this. For Car they did one for Carnival Night, Ice Cap, and Launch Base. And the Knuckles theme, too. That, that got changed later. It was a Knuckles theme like that then. But, uh, so... Uh, they also had this, like, prototype music that they had before Michael Jackson came in and made some of the music. So, uh, but, you know, of course, the Michael Jackson music was better. Uh, so they replaced it with this. Oh, we can go this way. They, re they replaced it. They replaced this with like the Michael Jackson music. So, but uh, you know, after Michael Jackson died and all that stuff, cause Michael Jackson wouldn't be credited. Uh, just uh, I think, uh, some people say it's because he didn't like the way the it sounded on the Genesis, so he didn't want to be credited. But uh, so you know, Sega was just able to use it and all that. But after he died, uh, you know, like the uh, the Michael Jackson stays all that they you know they didn't want to get sued, so for a while they just didn't release this game, and it was only like one time when they released it for like PC like a long time ago. Oh, we can go super now. So yeah, it was like only one time when they released it on PC a long time ago, where they made they used this music. Not this music, because I'm, I'm super now, but they used the prototype music. It sounded weird because it was on PC, and the P old PCs back then couldn't, you know, 
the, the, the soundtrack was just weird, but uh, yeah, they used a prototype music. Everyone thought it was just for that game, like the PC release. They're like, oh, this is bad. But then one day, like the actual prototype music got released, like people found found it, and they're like, oh my gosh, it's the stuff from the what, the PC port that one time. So yeah, so. People were cu curious if they're gonna release Sonic 3 again on Origins because of the Michael Jackson stuff, and people were like, "Oh, they're gonna use the prototype music," but uh, they didn't just use the prototype music. Jun Tsunoue, you know, the dude I was talking about, he came, he came to finish the prototype music because I guess the prototype music didn't seem like it wasn't finished, but uh, they they said it wasn't finished, so he came to finish it, but. Pretty much, uh, he kind of just made it bad. Like y'all can look up comparisons online. I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna. I don't really, it doesn't really matter. But if y'all want to see the the difference between the prototype and the the origins version of the prototype, y'all can see. But the prototype music really wasn't that bad. But I do like the Michael Jackson versions better, of course. But uh, yeah, prototype's not that bad, but it's. The Origins version of the prototype is really bad. I wouldn't say it's as bad as a PC, like, version, but it's pretty bad, so yeah. Uh, well, now we're at the Act 1 boss, and with this boss, you just want to uh, hit him to make him hit himself, pretty much. You gotta watch out for this thing, because you can't get hit, you can't get squished by it. So yeah, you just gotta hit him, and make him hit himself. And you want to hurry up, because that spinning top is, like, destroying parts of the stage, so... You don't want to fall in the pit, because if you fall in the pit, you die, so. And boom, that's that one. Yeah, because this version, like the original prototype version of this song, it, I actually like it. It's, it's not that bad. Oh, rings. Look at this rings. But, uh, this version, the Origins version, I don't know. The Jin you know, I know he, he started with Sonic 3 retro music, but uh, uh, he's not really good at making retro music anymore. I really, I, I kind of wish they got like someone like T-Lopes, the person that made uh, some of the music in the, well most of the music in the Mania. I wish they kind of got him to come back and, you know, finish the prototype music. I feel like it would have sounded better, but uh, it's whatever, you know, what can you do? There, there, you know, there are mods now, like, that when the game, like, came out, there was mods to change the music and fix it back to Michael Jackson and stuff, so. I just decided not to use the mods for the playthrough, so, you know, y'all could see, y'all could see how the game is, you know, straight out of the store, because, you know, especially people that don't have a PC or don't have a good PC, you know, they and want to get on a console, y'all can't get mods, so. I just wanted to show off the game how it comes when you buy it. Oh, I guess I'm going to bonus stage now. Yeah, this is the casino slot, slot machine one. That can get you some rings, you know. It's kind of like a mixture of Casino, Night, and the Sonic 1 special stage. Uh, I don't want to stay in here too long. I can just get 50 rings and then leave. Or I can lose them all. Watch, Watch me lose them all. Oh, okay. I got nothing. Let's all right. Let's leave. I'm ready to get out of here. I can't even. Oh my god. Let, let me out, please. Thank you. Oh my gosh. All right. And we're back to Carnival Night, but now we can go Super Sonic. So. Yeah, but like, well, also, yeah. Gene Snow is not really good at retro making retro music anymore. Yeah, but he's he is still good at making music. Oh, okay. Well, those are rings. I, did I go backwards? Is this me backwards though? I think it did. Oh my gosh, that really wasn't worth it. But, uh, but yeah, he's still good at making you know like most of the good hits he made is with the more of the modern soundtracks or like the the rock and stuff, which is which is really good. Yeah, you know, I'm. I'm not saying that Jutsu Noe is just really just bad now. He's just bad at making like retro style music now. Yeah. Uh, 
I want to get those rings, alright. But, uh, you know, that's enough about the music. We can just talk about the game now. That's pretty much all the, the stuff about it anyway. But, uh, <clears throat> I haven't really talked about Carnival Night. Carnival Night is, is an alright zone. You know, it has these barrels where you have to look up and down to make them go up and down. And they can launch you pretty far if you, if you sit here long enough. But it was like, it's like a meme that, you know, some people just don't know how it works. They're like, oh, like, they'll, like, cause this part, you have to know how they work. So you're like, oh, what am I supposed to do here? And if you don't know what to do, you'll just be stuck. So. But, you know, now everyone knows, you know, if you're in the loop, you know how they work. But I guess there, there might be some people out there that still don't know how they work, but, you know, you can just look it up now. But, uh, here's Knuckles, and he's gonna turn the power off. I don't know what's the point of doing that. I don't know how he's gonna stop us with, uh, by turning the power off. But, uh, uh, you know, I guess he's trying his hardest. And I died. Well, I guess turning the power off didn't really do something, because I killed myself. Well, you know, there goes Super Sonic. You know? Come on, Tails, give me a boost. Let's get this bubble shield so we don't drown. How did I die? I got squished by- that's not it. Oh, it goes down, so probably like the, the one, like, the first time it goes down, like on that frame, it killed me. That's crazy. Oh, I didn't expect it to do that. Good. Alright, but uh, you can also destroy the, the balloons and the water, they'll give you air bubbles, so. Yeah. Sonic 3, they give you a lot of bubbles so you don't drown. Yeah. And the water goes away eventually once you get right here. So. Damn, I did not expect that to happen. Oh, come on, dude. Come back down. Okay. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, I don't remember being this so bad this part, but uh, I guess I am. I guess I shouldn't have talked trash to Knuckles, you know. I shouldn't have been talking smack because now I'm, I'm dying. All right, uh, we're back here. And I just got hit again. All right, let's let's try not to die this time. Okay, come on, let me go down, please. I I just want to go down. I don't want to get squished. All right, come on. Listen, all right, there. We're, all right, we didn't get squished. Nice. Oh my God! Leave me alone. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get supersonic, cause... Cause there's definitely not enough rings, cause I, I've been hit too many times. Unless I find like a, a big ring or something. Okay, yep, there goes all my rings. Alright, now I have to find it. Okay, yeah, there, there goes every every other ring. Oh my... Can I not just not get hit? Like, please? I don't remember this being, being this bad at Carnival Night, so... Well, this is—I think this is in the zone right here. Oh, never mind. Okay, we got we got a lot left, so we could probably get super. Oh yeah, those are a lot of rings, actually. All right. Okay, 
They almost hit me. Well, I have a shield, so I'm fine. Alright, look, well, alright. Six more rings and we're good. Six more rings and we're good. Come on. Alright, we turn the power on. Okay, what am I doing? Okay, I don't want to squish my- I feel like that- no, actually. Okay, I thought there was a secret right here, I guess not. Come on, one more ring. Come on, one more. That's all I need. There. Let, let's let's save it real quick, you know. You never know what might happen. You gotta use this barrel to go down. Yeah, let's not squish ourselves. Come on. Invincibility. All right, that's good. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Invincibility never hurt anybody. You're joking. You're joking. Oh my gosh. This game just doesn't want me to get super. Oh my gosh. How is that? That's never even happened to me before. Getting, like, killed like that. Because usually it, the barrel will stop you. If you, when you're going fast. But no, it's just... I got there just in time to where I, I die. Well, we're probably not getting super now. There's, there's no way. Oh, it happened! What? What's going on? What? 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 Okay, no, no. This, this is stupid. Alright, let's... I'm gonna slow down. I'm gonna slow, slow down, slow down. Whoa, what is this? Am I, I'm not stuck here, I know that. Okay. Am I stuck here? Can I go up? Dude. Well, I gotta go fast. I mean, I guess that is what Sonic says. You know, I gotta go fast. But I don't want to go fast, though. I don't... I, okay, come on, Tails. Really? Oh, thanks. Okay, come on. Where does this go? I've never been this way, so... I don't know, it seems like this bottom route's giving me the rings I want, so... Well, I can go super now. I can't even see myself on the screen. Oh, hey Knuckles, what's up? What, what'd you just do? You didn't do anything, alright, whatever. Oh, we're going up now, we can't go that way. Oh hey, I can go supersonic, so I got my wish. And we can just destroy this boss. This boss is kind of a weird boss. He like drops the ball down, then shocks it, then picks it up. And usually when he picks it up, that's where you can hit him. But with supersonic, it's it's you don't have to worry about that all, all that stuff. But hey, I got supersonic. That was that was kind of crazy. I didn't expect all that stuff to happen, but whatever. Uh, but now we can jump in this cannon and go to Ice Cap Zone. But I'm going to save Ice Cap Zone for the next part. So uh, leave a like if you like this video. Subscribe if you want to support my channel. Ring the bell, get all notifications, all that. And that's it. So peace.